I will never again shop at a yard sale as long as I live. You ever shop at a yard sale? You like it? Really? What do you like about it? Cheap tables. Okay. I don't think I've ever needed a cheap table in my life before. But to me, it's like there's one thing I've found in life that's worse than shopping at a yard sale. Having your own. You ever do that? Sounds good in theory, just like communism. No one's been able to pull it off just yet. But it sounds good. Hey, man, I could use some extra money. I got some stuff in my house I'm not using. Got a couple of cheap tables and a couple of semi-cheap chairs. How about if I go in there and get all the stuff and bring it outside at 6 o'clock on a Saturday morning and sprinkle it all over my front yard so I can use it as bait to, to attract every inbred, hillbilly, low-life, wandering-eyed, cousin, humper, chain-wallet, piece of wrestling fan, humpback, snaggletooth, no-talent, unwashed, gap to toe jam shit ball and I mean that in a friendly and a customer service kind of a way in case any of those nice folks are with us here tonight yeah let's let those mongoloid window lickers from the short bus come limping across from the trailer park like night of the living dead and rifle through my memories of the last 25 years then try to talk me down at 6 in the morning. Yeah, that's exactly what I need in my life. Hey, a catheter with a Bill's logo. What do you take for that? <laughs> Woodwork squeaks and out come the freaks, man. And I can find them everywhere. If you did your Christmas shopping this year, there's one place where you never want to go shopping. It's even worse than a yard sale. That's the outlet mall. You been there? Oh, there's everywhere. Everywhere's got an outlet mob. And every, there's two words you never want to see when you're shopping. Take it from me. Slightly irregular. Okay? <laughs> Nothing is slightly irregular. It's shit. That's what it is. Let's be honest. If a Big Mac costs two fifty for a good one, would anybody in here pay a buck fifty for one with a couple of bites already out of it? No, it's shit. Just like the outlet mall. Frying pan, handle on the inside, shit. Three-piece bikini, purple, size 52. Shit. <laughs> Unless you're from Milwaukee. Then it's snug. <laughs> they tried to sell me a computer with a stutter. Would you buy one of those? It's 20 bucks off. You got to try it. Plug it in. Turn it on. You've got mail. Goodbye. Shit. A cell phone with a rotary dial. <laughs> Shit. Jeans, three bucks. That's a great price for jeans. How are they going to screw that up? I'm involved. It's always screwed up. I tried them on. Okay. What could the slight irregularity possibly be? How about the pocket over the crotch? How about that? <laughs> yeah. Could be that. Maybe that third leg shooting out of the ass. That might be it. Walking around like a snuffleupagus dragging it low. So. Hi, I'm another white guy you've never heard of. Dobie Maxwell, Mr. Lucky. When I'm looking at the Best Buy and computers for free, surfing for goat porn, I might slide over to ebombsworld.com when I'm in the mood for it, and I usually am. So you do it too. <laughs>